Hey, it's Sandra Peña de Latino 96.3, and right now I'm in the green room, the FYE in the city of Fullerton, as you can see, it's brown, but it's all good, because I am just super duper excited que en solo minutos, Romeo, el rey de la bachata, va a llegar en este mismito cuarto, and we're going to do an exclusive interview just for you. Romeo, you ready? Yeah. Cool. So stick around. It's Latino 96.3. Alright, Sandra Peña de Latino 96.3 and I'm in this green room, it happens to be brown but it couldn't be any brighter because I am sitting next to El Rey de la Bachata, Romeo Santos, hello! How you doing, how you doing? I'm good, I'm better actually now that you're here because we've been waiting for you ansiosamente, la gente está fuera. How does it feel to get somewhere and like actually have so many people because people don't wait for me like that. Ah, uh, <laughs> I would, I would. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's just truly an honor, you know, I'm really happy, excited to be in LA every time I come down here. I a lot of love from Mexican, Salvadorian, it's totally in the Latina. La Formula Volume 2. Tell me about it. Esto es más que una continuación, una evolución musical para mí. Eh, cuando estaba trabajando en volumen 1, yo sabía que un disco no iba a ser suficiente. Eh, tenía tantas ideas que por eso es que lo divido. Pero en este, este segundo disco, lo que le estoy ofreciendo al público es esos mismos elementos de, de bachata, confusiones de, de reggae, pero ese reggae de, 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 de Jamaica, Bob Marley style, dancehall con canciones, eh, colaboraciones con Nicki Minaj, Drake, eh, una canción con Drake que eh, gracias a todos los fanáticos está número uno, um, going on his fifth week. Um, and you know, I'm really excited about the whole album. Tengo una salsa también con mi gran amigo Mark Anthony. Wow. Eh, tengo también la participación de Carlos Santana actually playing in a bachata. Um, I have uh, eh, Kevin Hart in a skit. En el primer <laughs> álbum puse a George Lopez. Y, y esto fue como quería un concepto muy similar a, a lo que eh, presenté en, en Fórmula Volumen 1. So I'm just extremely happy with the album. How do you go about picking? the artist you want to work with? What makes you say, this is it? Um, to be honest with you, it, it, this is a really organic, you know, um, flow for me. You know, I, I, I never sit in the studio to think about the artist and then create the music. It, had, it has happened, it happened in volume one too, but um, it mainly works like this. I'm, I'm working on a song, eh, de la misma manera que estoy trabajando en, en mis otras canciones que no tienen que ver con colaboraciones y a veces estoy como wow esto le hace falta un complemento como, and I think about these big names porque soy un loco and you know I reach out and you know he sido muy afortunado de que todos han, han, han aceptado las invitaciones I mean from Kevin Hart you know from Drake Nicki you know everyone has just been open minded you know they love um, the, the, the Latino fan base, you know, and I think that that's where it begins. Me being Latino, I think they feel like, okay, this is something different for us as well. Well, before we get out of here, I have to show off his shoes. His shoes are awesome. Oh, <laughs> thank you, sweetie. <laughs> Love the style, and thank you so much for your time. And I'm gonna go hang out over there and try to get a picture. Is that cool? Of course. Of course. <laughs> Romeo Santos, El Rey de la Bachata, La Formula Volume 2, out in stores now. Mwah. Una aventura es más divertida si huele a peligro. Si te invito a una copa y me acerco.